Well, sitting right next to us, George Lopez, a writer, producer, actor who rose to fame through the comedy club circuit after years of sold-out stand-up shows. And his comedy has been on full display with sitcoms like The George Lopez Show and St. George and as host of the groundbreaking late-night show Lopez Tonight. And now he's taking a more dramatic turn in the new movie Spare Parts with his trademark brand of warmth and humor here with us, of course. The great George Lopez. Good to see you. Good to see you. Okay. Slats. Shins or smile. <laughs> you get hit in any part of your body. There Shins, you a smile, or in the slats. You gotta be careful saying those words. Those, yes, yeah. I got it. I'm, tongue I'm good with tongue twisters. You will be a different kind of funny video if you mess that up. Congratulations on this movie. Thank You're you. also producing. Yes. What is this stimulating in you to have that new challenge in front of you? Well, me? you know, this movie is about four kids who uh, from Arizona who um, entered a robotics competition. Uh, and they decided to enter against colleges because they thought if they lose to a college, it's not as bad as losing to high schools. And they won the whole thing with a robot that cost under $800. And they beat, like, MIT, they beat Cornell, they beat Stanford, they beat Harvard. So, you know, it is a powerful little movie that tells you that, you know, dreams uh, do come true and dreams don't have color. You know, anybody could dream and the American dream is still alive. And, you know, it deals with some issues of immigration, but, uh, you know, it, it is... Uh, it is everything that uh, we're dealing with today, especially with children, trying to tr keep children connected and in school. Mm -hmm. And uh, it's, uh, I think everybody will like it. Marissa Tomei is it, and Jamie yeah. Lee Curtis is in it, and then myself, of course. And Very a, dramatic in the movie. And, yeah. a, true, and a true story, which yeah. makes it yeah. all, all the better. This is obviously not the kind of role that people are used to seeing George Lopez in. You usually make us laugh. You're really good in this film. Is this a conscious pivot for you toward more serious stuff? You know, I thought that at this particular time, it would be good to show another side. You know, uh, um, Robin Williams was a friend of mine. Uh, Academy Award winner and Jamie Foxx as well and you know Michael Keaton with Birdman so you know I heard my whole life act right so I figured you know my grandmother might have been teaching me from an early age <laughs> you know I, I've been seeing the dog I said get off the couch those are all the things I heard hey stop chewing that what are you doing get off the couch go to sleep so it really does think that you know when I think about myself and I think about engineering these high school Latino kids that were engineers I was trying to make like Kool-Aid ice cubes and yeah. not spill water from the sink to the refrigerator. That, that, you know, I, was trying to, I was trying to burp the alphabet. You know, those, those are the things. You know, when we were kids, we, were we, we looked in the sun. We had nothing to do. Nice. Hey, what do you want to do now? Let's look in the sun. You got, like, juice from your cornea running down. You know, how many people oh followed God. a popsicle stick down the sidewalk when it rained? Hey, I, I'm winning. <laughs> you know, so kids out there, dream wherever you are. Leave right. the, stop chasing a popsicle stick or try to catch rain in your mouth. Get out there. Speaking <laughs> <laughs> of dreams, you're thinking. Of, are you thinking about running for mayor I of am. Los Angeles? Because it is time. The time has come. Yes. And I, I, listen, I can win with just fixing potholes. No. Come on, you know what I mean? So, so uh, we, we politics. You know, there's a lot going on in politics, yeah. and uh, and uh, it is. Uh, it, I, I would love to end my career as mayor of Los Angeles. And you're serious wow. about this. I'm absolutely about serious. Six yeah. years in from six now, years right? from now. Okay. Yes. Why I, six I, years? Why not now? Well, you know, I, I have to make churros yeah. to get votes. So it'll take me six years to finish baking all the churros that I will need. Uh, one churro, one vote. One man, one raindrop. One, you know, I used to try to, you know, one man will open the garage door without it falling on, falling on you. So I, I think politics is a great place for comedy as well. Will you come back here and an announce your official yeah. candidacy Absolutely. on today's tape? Absolutely. Oh and, you know, I'm still looking for a first lady. <laughs> <laughs> That's a different show. <laughs> seat in the back. Hey, creep it down out there. I'm getting lucky up here. Thank you, George. Mayor <laughs> <laughs> Opens Friday. My cheeks hurt. Oh.